first of all, it, you know, we we're happy to be here and playing today and, and, you know, at the tail end of the tournament. Um, you know, I'll start with the doubles. You know, I think just unfortunately we just didn't have enough answers. Um, it's probably the, the most lopsided, you know, they've played them so many times and I think they just really kind of came out on a mission today and, and, and you know, really attacked and played aggressive and we just, we didn't keep enough balls in the court. So, unfortunately it's, you know, not how, you know, with that we're being raised last match, not how we wanted it to end for her. But, um, but yeah, you know, I mean, gosh, they're Pac-10 champions, All-American. I mean, the, and so, I mean, the list of their accomplishments is, you know, numerous. So, you know, it's an unfortunate end for them today, but I mean, can't say enough of all that they uh, did for Cal as a doubles team. I think she's she's excited to be back in another final. She's been in every final of every tournament she's played since last, yeah, I guess, end this time last year. So, um, so I think for her, she really wants to take it that one more step. I think it's a, you know, she she's been working really hard this spring to kind of put herself in that position and be ready and be healthy and all those things you need so you know she never played tan so we'll see you know tan will have the crowd behind her hopefully we'll have a lot of bear fans here supporting yana but it'll be it'll be a great match i mean finals are always exciting and challenging and, and i'm just glad you know it's great we look here we're at stanford we got a great cal stanford match we, we were talking earlier about how many pac-10 schools are in the, the end of this tournament and it's just really it's great for our conference and and you know for college tennis so yeah we're excited to contest the final tomorrow yeah i knew the match is going to be really tough and um, i think i was mentally ready for it to be really challenging and um, you know she's a great player and uh, it was really i think it was a great match and the crowd was amazing too so that really helped me to like pull through it and it's nice to have something to rely on when it's really close and uh, yeah i think um, my model helped me a lot too. So it was a combination of things that got me through the match, and I trusted my game. So uh, I'm glad it worked out. It's different than play such a match for the first time, and uh, I think I just realized that nothing really changes. It doesn't matter like where I play or uh, how is the crowd or what's the score. Uh, yeah, and again, like I trusted my game. So I think. Um, yeah, I think I just uh, wanted to win really badly, and I I knew I can do that. So, um, you know, it will be similar to last year. It should be like a big, great crowd. But I just love these courts, uh, especially court number one. So I don't. It doesn't really matter to me. Why do you like court number one? Because we play here so often, and we have such great matches. And uh, yeah, I I've been used to playing on court one, and uh, yeah, I think I like the courts. <laughs> so. <laughs> You know, I think Stanford has very deep lineup, so there is no like surprises that someone from maybe not playing at the top made it uh, to the final. So I'm, I'm not surprised. Um, you know, it, it really doesn't matter who I'm playing. Uh, it's the bottom line. Like I, yeah, I just have to come and uh, play my game and uh, yeah, fight really hard. So it doesn't matter who is on the other side.